トーダイヤモンドチラニセオキマリデショープラウイノアナシノウモサスリササスイスイウイノアナシノウモサスリササスイスイヤチュノアナシヤイペウモサンユタイノマブヤガトルチスウンドウタビノジマリワミナミコノシマニウチルイナビカリウチナガコブネオドリダスカチャシウェラビオチトオバトセンゾカミガミ Two of the foremost clubs in English football, and they are ready for battle. It might well be a battle royal. Tottenham against Manchester United. Stay with us for live coverage right here on EA TV. Perfect weather, perfect stadium. This is the scene here at the home of Tottenham Hotspur in London. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur versus Manchester United. Well, that was a good result on match day one for United. Yes, there were a few tired legs towards the end of the game, but in the main, they looked a well drilled outfit. And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, here we can see just how good the cross from Rashford was, but the finish is far too easy. He doesn't even have to jump. How has he afforded that much space? It's a tidy header, but really poor defending. Away they go again. Now can Spurs come up with an answer? Kulusevski. United might be able to cash in. And defensive play to be applauded. Saar. Madison with it. And a Tottenham Hotspur free kick coming up. And fed forwards. Son. And he's through here. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. James Madison, really good challenge. Oh, in with a chance. And it's in for Manchester United. They are on a victory course. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. James Madison. Oh, they have it again. United could be onto something. Crossing possibilities. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Real chance. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. 
they make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Richarlison. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Oh, this is looking promising. And far from the ideal cross. Keeper's ball all the way. Pedro Porro. And on to Kurusevsky. Madison. Real defensive resilience. And Varane foiling them. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Oh, breezing past him. Is it going to be? Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Lisandro Martinez. Half-time then here... So the second half is underway, and I'll tell you what, Spurs know they really need to lift themselves. Kamavinga. And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. On. and the news confirmed before the game Manchester City have finally got their man Stuart well he's a great talent hopefully this move will see him play at his best week in week out it's a really good move for everybody Casemiro lost the ball Pat Matal Sar and Spurs moving the ball with purpose Richarlison and back with Madison no degree of difficulty at all for the keeper and he has options available now this could really lift spirits oh another one for them and with plenty of time still remaining this game is very much back on they get the ball rolling again Tottenham trailing but within touching distance now Florian Wirtz chance to cross and stopping the danger well good effective pressure well a really good run Really vital interception. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV, and looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Bournemouth. Madison. Nicely timed tackle. 
Uh, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Could be threatening. Oh, he saved it well. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Playing it in. Well, not cleared away completely. But it just petered out. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Well, let's call it a meaty effort, but certainly not accurate enough. Kamavinga. Ten minutes to go. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Nottingham Forest. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. How about the cross? Decided to come in from the flank. That could cost them at this late stage. Well, that should have been the equaliser. I'm not sure they'll get another chance now. Frimpong. Here's Isaac. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Is this the moment? And a goal! They lead by two now! And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance, all told? Well, I've been really impressed. Just a couple of questions for you. Thanks, that's all the questions we have for you.
Our camera's on one man. Four goals in three games. You can't argue with that. The action is live next. Hello there, sad to say the weather hasn't cooperated today. It's absolutely lashing down here at Old Trafford. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Manchester United and they face Nottingham Forest. Well, Derek, it's just the start to the season United were expecting. They've been efficient with the ball, they've looked threatening and they've deserved their two wins. They'll certainly be tough to beat today. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Well, although it's down as a 4-5-1, it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre-forward. And those three are key to this team's creativity. Wonderful chance! Well, he opted for power from close range. He might be regretting that now. And here's how Nottingham Forest will line up. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. A good and fair challenge. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, I expect him to score again today because he's got four goals in the last three games. He's looked outstanding when he's been running in behind, and I expect him to cause this Oh, defense. the chance is on, Stuart! Well, what a stop it was! Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Failure to keep the ball by Nottingham Forest. More than decent this from United. And a chance for the lead. In it goes! The goal for 1-0. And that changes the dynamic. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly. He gets beyond his marker and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Well, back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Rashford Shaw and crossed in there Well, just look at this. He couldn't have hit it any better, could he? This is the perfect example of a bicycle kick. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Good visualisation and execution. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And he's fired over the corner. Well, not the best clearance. And a long way out. And foiled only by the crossbar. And still dangerous. Well, the woodwork has just denied them a three-goal lead here. But you just can't see them throwing this one away, can you? Oh, lovely bit of skill. Good-looking cross. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there.
They take it short. Turning inside, where's he going to go? Can't miss, surely! Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. Short corner it is. Good-looking driven ball. Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Marcus Rashford. Well, from so far out, it didn't appear to be the high percentage option. Close, though, Stuart. Well, he did have options, but that was a good effort in the end. He wasn't too far away, was he? Might be able to get in behind the defence. That's a nice-looking ball. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Playing it in. And what a magical save it was! And the problem not completely solved. Hudson-Odoi. And there goes the whistle. That closes the book on the first half here at Old Trafford. So the ball moving again. United having already made a big first-half statement. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. United doing well to regain possession. And the story now confirmed, Spurs have got their man, Stuart. Well, he's a great talent. Hopefully this move will see him play at his best week in, week out. Will it be? And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Corner kick played in. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. I'm trying to build a head of steam. Another corner it'll be. And keeping it out. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And fired against the crossbar. Well, not cleared away completely. Diogo Dallo. Body in the way. In a decent position now. And well, they're almost inviting them to come at them. Giovanni Reina. It's a fine United move in the making. Excellent ball towards the front post. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Real chance! And the volley onto the woodwork. I think he was a bit unlucky there. Well, you can say he's a bit unfortunate, but I think he should be hitting the target and scoring there. Don't forget, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Arsenal. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should be a really feisty affair.
Henry Martin. And unable to find the target, they put themselves under pressure and have to start finishing chances. Well, frustration amongst the players. That was half a chance to reduce the deficit there. Florian Wirtz. Encouraging stuff from United. And passing through. And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop him. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place. But give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. So on with the game again. United in charge. The scoreline threatening to get ugly. Hudson Odoi. Well, nicely cut out. Ryan Yates. I'll just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Nottingham Forest taking on Chelsea. United being afforded too much space. Now let's see about the cross. And everyone in the centre looking on as it sailed over them. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And a substitution in the offing. Kuyase. Nico Williams. Not showing good defensive judgment. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. Anthony. Flag raised for offside. And the referee blows for full time. Positives for Manchester United. Three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, it's another good display. Sick of these dudes, sick of the tunes, don't like listening, illest of mood, I'm illest on tune, stated from start, except when P take part, that's when I spark, ignite like guilty spark, I want to pop. Trying to tip your whole planet into shape, so we can listen, it's the bake of the century. You'll remember my soft soul tones when everything don't make sense, it's a mystery, I'm gone without reason, understanding on a zilch heart, got squilt, dropped off the edge, I never climbed back, stayed put in a cave of strange, had to rearrange the brain, prioritise I, life is strange, that's just it, that's just life, last time I checked I'm doing the right, cause I'm still on mic, I'm still alive, still carry weight when I spray, you can't damn my light, too much bright, too much shine in the presence of the essence, that's right. And I'm still sounding nice, Hiller and P on beat, that's absolutely tidy, don't Miss me with that he said, she said, yeah, the energy sending me to the deep end. We said it clever, you're definite with the pretense. See it in your step, you're heavily on the defense. I speak less the same, more of a silence, check the repertoire, second star. They bang we a metal boss, takes free to tango, beat you with my bangles. He ill a pitch, eating freaking out the angles. Uh, I'm in the buy and the flash jaguar, pack jeans, talk about the bag, you couldn't buy a Walking fire trap, but now you're napping, trying to find Walk around your gaff, have it your wifey's back on. It's barely legal how I slay a beat. Take a seat, ADHD and HD, best can see defeat. London town, love, love. I never sleep on peeps. These so greasy, even vegans try to eat the meat. Turn it chat to tell my, no, I said yo. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm on some back of things, back of things. 
from nine two. And I can give you by your crew a one two. A one two. Turn they chat to tell my No, I said yo. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm on some back a day, back a day from nine two. And I can give you by your crew a one two. A one two. Turn they chat to tell my No, I said yo. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Back some back a day from nine two. And I can give you. By your crew, a one two, a one two. Friend, they tried to tell me, so I said, yo, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm on some back of these, back of these, from nine two, and I can give a by your crew, a one two, a one two. J'ai la plume incandescente, mes yeux s'écarquillent Dans mes rêves fluorescents, y'a des jaguars au ralenti La terre est en détresse, j'entends geindre les dieux La colère, la tendresse, laisse-moi joindre les deux Ma voix est une galaxie Mes yeux sont révulsés J'ai de la magie J'ai de la magie Jusqu'à jusqu'à la facie J'entends le cœur qui s'en va Tremble le fleur, je me sens mal La fin du temps qui s'emballe J'écrase, 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 j'écrase Comme des forêts qui s'embrasent Et le mercure qui s'enflamme Laisse le monde se... London calling And I very much hope you're ready You'd better be Because this could be special Arsenal against Manchester United, two of the biggest clubs in England, and they're about to lock horns next, live on EA TV. And this is the scene here at the Emirates Stadium in North London, and I'm delighted to be able to report that it's a perfect day weather-wise. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Arsenal taking on Manchester United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And a long way out. No way through. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the centrepiece of the attack today is Gabriel Jesus. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Well, plenty of attacking width in this 4-3-3, but they'll need to get their midfield players to join the centre-forward as much as possible. If not, he'll become isolated. Will he play it in? Oh, the threat is there. And the cross goes in. The high press was on, and the chance is on. Got to it easily, the keeper. Frimpong. Well, this is the day, his debut forthcoming, and it's going to be fascinating to see what he produces. Stuart, what do you think we should expect to see from him? Well, he's a dangerous player when he gets himself isolated in 1v1 situations because he can drop a shoulder, manipulate the ball, and change his pace to beat defenders. I just hope he starts well today. And fed forwards. Rashford! And there it is, the opening 
goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here it is again. The little one-two starts it all off, and Rashford's finish gives the keeper no chance. He hits it with such venom. So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Alexander Zinchenko. Martin Odegaard. Rice. It's looking promising. Is it going to be? And at the second time of asking, it's a goal. The keeper, meanwhile, looks to the heavens. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Bruno Fernandes has it. Good tackle, take it away. Plenty of support here. Rice. And Arsenal have won the corner as they try to take the lead. And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession! No wonder they're celebrating! And as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Bruno Fernandes has it. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And still pressing. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. That's a good-looking ball. And it's in! A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. trying the chip but he got the execution all wrong well if he had the chance again i think he'd choose another option not even close in the end bruno fernandes has it and intercepted it but he's certainly not alone from long range really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing and the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute And time is up as far as the first half. So the match has restarted here in Manchester. Nicely timed tackle. Pedro Gonzalez. An encouraging Arsenal move. Gives it a go. Well, that's a foul and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Oh, a really well hit.
free kick, but no goal at the end of it. Yeah, it's a great strike, but he just couldn't squeeze it inside the post. So unlucky. Well, you can't take your eyes off this one, because there you have it. Plenty of chances for both teams in what has been a really good game so far. Martin Odegaard. Well, Chelsea making waves on the transfer front, and he could be available before you know it, Stuart. Yeah, at that price, I think he's value for money. He'll certainly improve their squad and maybe the team. It's a good signing, you have to say. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Florian Wirtz. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Intelligent threaded pass here. And offside, unfortunately. Pedro Gonzalez. Alexander Zinchenko. Declan Rice. Oh, this is looking promising. It should be. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Now they stopped them in their tracks. Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Arsenal facing Everton. Oh, what a chance this is, Derek. What a lovely strike! Lethal piece of finishing, drilled home with true conviction. Tremendous goal! Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. On with the game then, 3-2, what will happen next? Mount. Nicely cut out. And maybe Rashford! Oh, a chance to put them at an even better position. Well, he's got to hit the target there. What a waste that is. And time for the change now. Well, this is certainly the home of live football, EA TV. And looking forward to bringing you more action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United taking on Brighton. He fancies it. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Wirtz. Just 10 minutes to go. Well, these Arsenal fans can sense an equaliser here. Can the players respond and get it? Martin Odegaard. Bukayo Saka. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Gonzalez. The clock is against Arsenal, but what can they pull out of the fire here? Chances on. Can he find the net? He had to score, and he does. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending.
So the current scoreline, 4-2. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance all told? Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today. And fed forwards. Is it all right if we just ask you a couple of questions? Thank you, that's all the questions we have for you.